nice question here. We're assuming this is like flat on the table and we want to know the largest number of coins we can remove so all the rest of them cannot slide. So let's say we just took away the top, well, the one furthest up. Then um, if we took away one that was next to it, then that one could go into the gap. So actually that's going to apply anywhere. If you took this one and this one, then this one could go into the gap. So we can't ever take two that are adjacent. Um, so if we went and took this one away, then I can't take that one or that one. Um, I could try and take that one away, but then I wouldn't be able to take any of those three, which would only leave me one here. So I can do three. Three would be possible. Because if I took those three away, actually, all the rest of them wouldn't be able to slide. That one can't go into there. There's not enough gap to get through. Question is, can we do any better than that? And the answer is yes, because what if we went with all the corners? Okay, so now I can't move that one, that one, that one, or that one, but I could move the very center one. They would still then, none of them would be able to move into that gap, and none of them would be able to move into the corner. So four is possible. Five is not possible because, um, you know, you just can't, like, as soon as you try and do five, you're going to have one that is necessary, like two are going to be adjacent. But hopefully I'll convince you that four is possible and that is going to be our answer.